It is the weekend. Good morning. I'm taking over the vlog for today. Sarah's not gonna touch the camera at all. You'll see her. She's not touching the camera. But we are starting our day off with breakfast. We are probably, probably going to McDonald's unless it's like super, super busy and then we'll go to Bojangles. This one right here is definitely the best. Sausage, egg, and cheese McGriddle. It's like miniature pancakes with built-in syrup. And I made a sandwich out of it. Like, ah! I love these things. They're really unhealthy for you, but I, I can't resist them. Sarah's got bacon, egg, and cheese on a homemade biscuit. Yeah, they made it homemade this morning. Oh yeah. All right, so we finished our breakfast. And Sarah went for a drive, on a drive with her mom, because her mom got a new car yesterday. But she doesn't know is that the boys are both asleep, so when she comes back, she's got no responsibilities right now. Guess what? Yeah. You have no responsibilities right now. They're both sleeping. You don't have to feed anybody, you don't have to chase anybody. I have to go pump. You can, <laughs> you can go do whatever you want, even if that's pumping. Oh man, I forgot about pumping. <laughs> I thought she was going to be excited to just have I nothing see. to do. I can't find my pieces. Uh-oh. I can only find the one bottle. Well, we're going to have to go on a hunt then. And so the other downside to Spectra is that their like, pieces are really expensive. Now, I can order a hack, and it's like a little thing that hooks into the Spectra, and then I can attach my Medela pieces, but I don't know if I'm going to do that. But I've lost one of my bottles already. Oh, my God. We're going to have to find it. Somebody's learned a new skill. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? I think he wants to play in the wagon. You want to get in that wagon? Okay. I'm taking over the vlog for today. Sarah's not going to touch the camera at all. Yep. Jameson, who's in the bucket with you? Hey, Omar's in my wagon. Yay! Okay, I gotta get out. <laughs> you leave me in there with you. Okay, let me get out. That's the sheep goes. <laughs> this is a horse. Okay, what toy are we gonna get next? This one, this one makes noise. Yeah, this one makes noise. We'll turn it on. And then we hit the buttons. Like the green side? To all the sides. <laughs> Look at you. Uh oh, do we need more toys? We've already got one, two, three, four, five. I'm taking over the vlog for today. Sarah's not going to touch the camera at all. Yep. I'm cheating. I'm not supposed to be vlogging today, but I just had to capture this snuggle. Jameson doesn't snuggle with me anymore. He was never really that big of a snuggler, but um, 
you know, he co-slept for a while and I always loved that until he got old enough to realize that he wanted me to wake up. And um, I remember one morning I woke up to him sticking his fingers up my nose and I was like, what is touching me? And I woke up and Jameson was just like, hey mom, how you doing? But just look at this snuggle. I love this. I love sleeping with my babies on me. It's like the best feeling in the world. It's just like, I don't know how to describe it. It's just, it feels so good to sleep with my boys. Oh, oh, do you want me to stop talking? See, mama, you're ruining our perfect moment. Somebody's awake and not quite ready to go, but look at him loving on his brother. Yeah, that's your brother, Finn. Are you falling? Oh, now he's trying to make an escape. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. See, so I'm don't tickle me when I mama. just woke up, Mama. Are you ready to go, bye byes? Are you ready to go, bye byes? You want to go to the grocery store? He said, Oh, not the store. I'm taking over the vlog for today. Sarah's not going to touch the camera at all. Yep. See, Daddy, hurry up. We're burning alive out here. I actually just had the car on, but Robert's been in there for like 10 minutes now, and I don't want to run all the gas out of the car that we just put in the car. Here he comes, finally. He's shaking his head, so apparently something interesting happened. But look, guys, I don't know if you can tell, but I have squeezed myself in between these two car seats. How do you fit? And I fit pretty well. You look good back there. Jameson was doing really cute stuff, so I attempted to get it on camera and he stopped. So I'm not doing a very good job at being the only vlogger today. I told you. Are you coming back up? Yeah. Okay. Here, take this because I'm. I take camera. I love you. Oh, this looks like it's so easy. Are you stuck? No, it just takes a minute to get my hip. I have big hips, guys, like really big hips. Yes, I do, and you know it. No, I don't. I do not know that. But um, this is a great <laughs> shot down your shirt. Cafe Mama. Is that cafe, what you called it? <laughs> cafe, cafe de Mama. <laughs> Into the vitamin shop for breast milk supplements. Sarah's on her way in to get a whole bunch of herbs. She doesn't like when I say herbs. But that's how it's spelled. I don't know, I don't know what other language has silent letters. But yeah, it's herbs. This is like a herb garden, just it's all plucked and picked and put into capsules already. Now we just wait for her to get back. All right, well it's also been like five whole minutes now. 10 minutes. 15 minutes. An hour. All right, it's been like an hour and a half. I'm gonna have to go in there. I don't know what's going on. It's a tiny little store. Jameson, we're getting out of the car. We're gonna go find Mama. Finnegan, you're coming too. You wanna go get Mama? Let's go get Mama. She's been in there way too long, like an hour and a half. And we don't have any phones, so I, get in, I can't call her and see what's going on. God, it is about time. God, what took so long? We were just getting ready to go in there after you. An hour and a half in the vitamin shop? Well, that guy was super fine. An hour and a half. <laughs> no, um, it took me a minute to find the alfalfa, and then I decided to get two because they were buy one, get one half off. Oh, so I got very nice. less. It wasn't really an hour and a half. It, it was, was like, like not maybe, even 10 minutes. Yeah. Jameson thought my joke was funny. <laughs> but look. Did you get your other one too? Uh, I did. You got two alfalfas and one blessed, blessed thistle. thistle. What was we made it to the grocery store. It's getting really late today though. Time is just like We were by lazy us. like all day. Well, I mean we it's couldn't leave because he was napping. Jameson, don't pull your brother's blankets off. He needs those. He needs those so too? he doesn't get cold. Are you cold? You can he share. Actually, he's actually cold. Poor guy. But yeah, we finally made it to the grocery store. It's been a long 
lazy day, but like we couldn't leave because Jameson was napping. And now we're probably about to have a little fight. So we start with produce. We've got potatoes, red bell pepper, onion, three zucchini, red onion, blackberries, and blueberries. Cold goods. Two things of coffee creamer. Half and half, not for coffee though. Two things of milk, Jameson's and ours. Shredded cheese, and that's that. Just so you know, there's a lot of like dry goods, you know, the, the not so cold stuff. So I'll show you that when we get home. There's a lot of it. You all right? Yeah. Or it was vlogging at the registers, which like mortifies me beyond, beyond anything. And we got a lot of really weird looks. Are you embarrassed? Yeah. <laughs> Why are you embarrassed? Because it's a little bit embarrassing. People watch this all over the world. I know, but when you're in that close quarters with people and they don't understand what you're doing, it always makes me feel like people think we're filming them. That's true. Oh my God, I forgot the OJ. So I took the babies, Sarah's at the register. I'm gonna find some OJ. All right, I thought our car was fairly big and then we put two car seats in it and then it got really small. And then we tried to put a month's worth of groceries in it. And you can't see anything. It's all groceries and a double stroller. Look at that, it's full. I mean, it's just full, like to the top of groceries. The door didn't even shut off. It's much better, it's just, it's just so full. Now that we're home, I've got two more categories. First one is baby stuff. Apple cookies, banana cookies. I'm not gonna show you all three of them, but three things of this soy formula for Jameson. And one big thing of this sensitive formula for Finnegan and two things of yogurt bites. That's it for baby. For the dry stuff. Mac and cheese with dory on it. Veggie or corn. Ranch. Special K protein bars. Two boxes. Cookies, cookies, cookies. Cheez-Its. Cheez-Its. Uh, I guess these are oatmeal bars? Granola bars? They count as cookies. Count as cookies. Balsamic vinaigrette. Mustard. Popcorn. Doritos. The orange juice I forgot. Kettle chips. And these cinnamon like Dorito things which are really awesome. And oh. And noodles. It was kind of a long shopping haul, I'm not gonna lie. But it was kind of fun. Right, 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 fun. Too rushed. I had a blast. You guys, no, you best didn't. day of my life. No, 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 Best day of my life. It was too rushed. We didn't have enough time and it's already like getting late. Like, look, 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 look. 7.03. It's kind of Jameis' bedtime and he hasn't even had dinner yet, so we're gonna hurry. You wanna know what makes us awesome as parents? What? It's just after 7.30, almost 7.40, and we did get Jameis into bed on time. We can't say that we're awesome yet. Well, we did, we did skip a bath. Because we don't know if and he's actually going to go to sleep. We don't, yeah, no, we don't know that. But I mean, you're managing to make us dinner while breastfeeding. And, you know, we still got him in bed at the right time. Your pants are out of it. Yeah, I know. I'm in a hurry. I'm still, we're still in go mode. Like, we're still, like, running to try to get things done in time. But we did it. We got him in his bed at the right time. You guys want to see something cool? We did this with Jameson on my due date, uh, September 27th of last year. And so we're gonna get like a side-by-side -side picture to do with it. But today is our due date. We would be 40 weeks gestation today. So. That would be in my body. Oh my goodness. He's so tiny still. Now, of course he would have put on a little extra fat in there, but. Look at you, little guy. Look at you. He's like, okay, okay, I want to eat now. Good morning. Good morning and good good night at the same time because this is the end of our vlog. It was a, a late night, so I, I didn't finish the vlog on time. But as you can see, I did not do very well at not letting Sarah hold the camera. She did pretty well. <clears throat> you, you held the camera three times. I was supposed to take over was the vlog. priceless every time. Yeah, it was. It's, it's time, time for 
subscriber shout out. He's like, He's looking at us like we're crazy. Tonight's subscriber shout out goes to bum -ba -da -da, Jessica Simmons. Jessica Simmons says, My puppy turns one on October 7th, and I told my husband that I was going to throw him a party. At least now I know I'm not the only one who does it. This dog is the first one that I actually have that actually knows his birthday. But we will be moving in the next couple months, so hopefully I am able to do something for him. Where are you going? Because I'm making a run for it. <clears throat> on another note, I saw the title of your vlog and immediately had to watch it because I thought something happened. But very thankful Finnegan is alive as well. He is adorable and I love seeing him in all the vlogs. But boy does he know how to throw a fit when he is not getting his own way. Because as soon as you picked him up, he was a happy baby again. Gets it from his brother. That's true. But I totally and wholeheartedly <laughs> think that you should throw your puppy a party. Oh, most definitely. <sighs> And good luck with your move. I know that sometimes they're, you know what? Every single move is stressful. It doesn't matter what kind of move it is. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it's stressful. Jameson's running away, so we're gonna you end this. You could be moving on up. It's stressful. If you enjoyed this vlog, <clears throat> give it a thumbs up. I have no thumbs. Yes, you do. Ah! Baby's trying to crawl off the edge of the bed. Um, leave it I've comment. gone by a foot. Check us out on social media and subscribe. Bye. Bye. We love you guys.